everyone, Alex here. Welcome to my channel and welcome to this workout. So, you want to lose fat in the next 14 days, you've come to the right place. All you've got to do is repeat this workout for the next two weeks for incredible results. This is a low impact HIIT workout, 45 seconds work, 15 seconds rest, eight exercises for three sets. Are you ready? Let's go. Here we go, taking it into some arm circles. We are taking it into a two minute warm up before we go into the low impact fat loss circuit. Also, it's extremely windy today, so if there's some background noise or you're wondering what this fluffy thing is on my chest, then now you know. Let's take it into a side reach, reaching over both sides, keep it moving, Take nice deep breaths, warm up and activate the body. Reach the fingers up nice and high, lengthen through the spine, the side muscles. And let's take it into a crouch to hamstring stretch. So, Crouching down, stretch your toes, your ankles, and then lift up, stretch your hamstrings around the back, come between these two positions, lengthening in the knees, the ankles, and then stretching through the back. So this whole workout is apartment friendly, it's low impact, good for whether you've got some injuries that you've got to look after as well. Okay, place your hands down, step back, alternate climber step stretch. Step one, foot up, feel the stretch. Step back and switch. Hips, groin, adductors. Final 30 seconds here, and we take it into the circuit. 45 seconds work, 15 seconds rest, eight exercises times three. Okay, rest there, I'm gonna change the timer. Two, 45 and 15. We're gonna start an exercise one, which is marching on the spot. Are you ready? In three, two, one, let's go. Marching on the spot. We have options. Stay light on your toes for this light hopping march. If you struggle in the ankles at the moment, then just a flat foot march. Or if you don't mind a bit of impact, you can run or jog if you wanna increase the intensity here. It's up to you, it's your workout, and however you're feeling today, or whether you've got neighbors underneath that complain. <laughs> Drive the knee up, keep the speed up to get the heart rate up and burn the calories. And rest there, 15 seconds rest, before we go into a squat punch. So set your feet in a squat position. You're gonna go into like a half squat, punch, half squat, punch. Keep the speed up, keep moving, good technique. Let's go, squat, punch, down. Keep up the speed and good technique. Twenty seconds to go. Keep going. So, in this workout, we're doing a mixture of strength training and high heart rate cardio training because this is the combination we need to transform our bodies, burn fat, shape our bodies up. Keep going. And rest there. We're going to take some upper body strength into our push-up. Down onto the floor. Hands on the floor. Get into a push-up position. You can keep your knees on the floor if you need to. Otherwise, strong, good technique, push up. Let's go, slow down, stretch the chest, push up strong.
20 seconds, keep up the tempo. If you slow down and really struggle, then drop the knees, carry on. Building strength, shape, and tone in the upper body, chest, shoulders, arms. Building muscle helps us burn fat. And rest there, well done, shake it off. Back up you come, enjoy the rest. And let's take it into some leg strength, alternate reverse lunge. So, from a standing position, take a big step backwards, reverse lunge, stand up and switch legs. Let's go, keep breathing, keep pushing. Back knee down towards the floor, front foot flat on the ground, push through your toes and your heels into the floor. If you are ready for higher impact and you have the ability to do so in your body and also wherever you're training, you can lunge jump if you want. And dress there, well done. Is your heart rate up? You feel out of breath? We're working. Down we go into mountain climber back into this push-up position, but now we're gonna drive the knees up one at a time to work our core and heart rate. Let's go, one knee up and switch. Keep your body stable, push away from your hands. Not much moves apart from those knees coming up. Keep it going, knees up, into the chest. Squeeze the abs. And rest there, well done. 45 seconds is tough, huh? Let's take it into an alternate front kick. So, front kick, pow. Step, step, other leg. Step, step, other leg. Get that front kick. The higher, the more flexible you are. Let's go. And if you are flexible, you can even consider touching your toes if you want. Keep up the speed and the tempo if you want to keep up the heart rate and burn more calories. Ten seconds. Keep going. And rest there. Well done. Ruining my mat with that one. Okay, let's take it into the bear crawl. This is a tricky, tough, tough one for the shoulders and the abs. We're going to bear crawl forwards and backwards, depending on how much space you have. Here we go. Knees off the floor. Step with hands and feet, however far you want to go or can go, and walk backwards. There's no rush, but just keep on moving. Don't stop. Keep your knees down, nice and low. Forwards and backwards. Keep going, 15 seconds. Four strong, six, five. Well done, rest there, good work. Oh, enjoy the rest. Let's go down onto the ground for the final exercise. A bit of core to finish the circuit. Hands behind you, stay up. We're gonna extend the body and the legs. Let's go, crunch it in, extend, crunch it in, extend, crunch it in. Work those abs, stay safe in the lower back, long spine. 
but keep up the speed as well. Building strength in abs, hip flexors, all over core. Keep going. If you need to rest and do one leg at a time, that's fine as well. You can rest at any point. Good, rest there. So that is eight exercises. Let's start again from the top with no rest. Straight in to the marching. Back up you come. So if we do that round for three sets, then we're taking it into a 30 minute workout. Let's go. Either jog, marching, hopping march like this, up to you. So this 30 minute workout, including warm up and cool down and a one minute finisher. And if you wanna make it longer or shorter, you just increase or decrease the rounds of these eight exercises. Rest there, well done. Get ready for your squat punch. In your squat position, get ready to punch. Deep breaths in. Let's go, squat, punch. Keep up the speed, keep the pace, strengthen the legs. Keep your heels down on the floor, your bum going back and down. Ten seconds, keep going. And rest there, well done. Down is the push-up. Remember, have a drink whenever you need, stay hydrated. Let's go. Down, push, down, push. Keep breathing throughout. Breathe in, down, out, up. Drop the knees if you need. I want to keep up the speed of the one-one ratio, down and up. Rest there, well done, up you come. We are shaping up the whole body with this workout, strength and cardio. Let's take it to that alternate reverse lunge. Step back, lunge, step up. Step back, lunge, step up. Keep up the speed and good technique. If you want a higher impact workout, then do a higher impact lunge if you can. Three. Two, well done, breathe, rest, recover. Make sure in these 15 seconds you are breathing. Deep breaths in through the nose. Let's take it down into that mountain climber.
Let's go, push up position, knees up, one at a time. You have the option of stepping with control or pick up, picking up the speed and jogging, running. Pull in that belly button, tense the abs, 20 seconds to go. Ten seconds, don't stop. Well done, rest there. Epic work, keep going. Let's take it into that front kick. Alternating front kick. Think of something, someone that makes you angry. Let's take some energy out. Front kick, pow, step back. Let's go. Option, knee drive. Knee drive, if you're struggling the hamstrings or the legs or the energy, knee drive, good option. Eight, seven, keep it up. And rest there, well done. Let's take it down into that bear crawl. <sighs> On your hands and toes, knees down low. Walk forward for a few steps, walk back for a few steps, however much space you have. Let's go. Opposite hand and foot moves at the same time, simultaneous. Get that timing and then pick up the speed. Halfway. Now, pick, can you pick up the speed? Walking, walking. Eight, seven. Hand rest there, well done. Exercise eight out of eight. For round two, the knee tucks. Let's build the abs, the hip strength. Sit back, fingers forward or outwards. And let's extend the body and pull. Extend the body, pull. Use your hands to support yourself. But when you drive the knees up, squeeze and tense the abs. Keep it going, knees up, chest up. And rest there, well done. Two rounds, complete. Let's do it one more time, okay? Let's go from the top. Marching on the spot or a jogging march or just running on the spot if you're up for it. Let's go. Knees, knees, march it. Use your arms, get those knees up and hop on the toes. Fifteen seconds. If you've fatigued in your calves and ankles, stepping marching is fine. Hand rest there, well done. 
Let's stay here for the squat punch. Squat. Let's go. Punch, punch, punch. Keep your chest up, long spine. Keep your fists in front of your chin. Twenty seconds. Right to the end. Five, four. Well done. Breathe it in. Let's go down into our push up. Are you ready? 45 seconds of push ups. Let's go. Keep up that timing of one down, one up. If you can't keep it up, drop the knees. Squeeze the chest, the shoulders, and the arms. Keep it going. I know it's getting tough. Get, keep pushing through. And every time you redo this workout, See how much stronger you get. Well done. Rest there. Oh, that's a big chest and shoulder burner. We're shaping up our bodies. And the sweat is certainly here. That's for sure. Are you ready for the legs? Do will turn it, reverse lunge. Let's go. Step back, step up. Step back, step up. Make sure your glutes are working here. Push through the heel, engage the bum. If you're breathing heavily, you're working. We are getting fitter, we're getting stronger. We're transforming our bodies every day. Stay focused. Well done, shake it off, epic work. Breathe it in, recover and rest before we take it down into mountain climber. Let's go, push up position, knees come up into the chest. Speed up to you. If you can jog it or run it, it's gonna be better for today's workout. Don't stop, to the end, 10. Hand dress there, well done. Shoulders fatiguing. Let's go into the front kick. Your version, I introduced the knee option, the front kick, make it as dynamic as you want. Let's go. Kick, step, step, kick, step, step. The whole point of this workout is to keep on moving. Whatever intensity you can do, breathe, keep moving.
to you, baby, but I lied to you. Don't you know it's true? Girl, there's no one else but you, but I lied to you, baby, yeah. Well done, rest there, we are so close. Stay with it, right to the end. Let's take it into the bear crawl, forwards and back. Three, two, one, let's go. Bear crawl, forwards, back. Keep up the speed, keep your knees down. Move opposite hand and opposite foot at the same time. Land them at the same time. Lift them off the floor at the same time. Knees down an inch off the floor. Rest there. Well done, we're so close. Stay with it, stay with it. Let's hit the ground for the seated knee tuck. 45 seconds of ab burner. Let's go, extend, pull. Breathe, I know you're out of breath. Breathe and keep going. Challenge yourself, you'll surprise yourself. What you can achieve if you stick to it. If it's tough, lay on your back for a single leg. If you want, if you need at any point. After this, we have a one minute finisher. Well done. One minute, okay? It's time to introduce the burpee. A stepping burpee for no impact. Hands down, step back, step in, stand up. Option one. Option two, hands down, jump back, jump in, stand up. Let's go, one minute. Your version, stepping option. Take your time, otherwise, any burpee that you're up for today. If you're doing a stepping burpee, alternate the leg that you start with. Stay with it, stay with me. Keep going. Fifteen seconds left. Don't stop. This is it. End of the workout now. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Workout complete. Take a deep breath. Recover. That heart rate needs to come down. Your breathing rate needs to come down. Stay with me for one and a half, two minutes of cool down recovery drink. Hold on to something if you want, before taking it into a quad stretch. Take nice deep breaths in, lift one heel up. Ah, oh, recover, breathe, deep breaths. Ease the hips forwards. Control that breathing down, recover. The fitter you are, the quicker you can recover from these exercises. Switch legs, other side. Don't click off the video now. Enjoy this moment, this moment of presence with yourself, your body, your mind, to realize that you just did that. Before you go on to whatever you wanna do, for the rest of the day. Just feel that sense of accomplishment. Well done. Final stretch, a forward fold, feet hip width apart, soften the knees, 
drop forwards. Relax your head, your chin, soften the knees, and then lift the hips slowly to feel that lengthening in the hamstrings, the back. Deep breath in, breathe out, exhale, relax. Roll it up to standing and well done. All you've got to do is come back tomorrow and for the next two weeks and repeat that with me. But make sure if you want the best results in losing fat quickly, you have to partner this with a healthy lifestyle and healthy nutrition to make sure you're getting that calorie deficit to burn fat, okay? If you need any help with that, I have a nutrition guide and one-to-one -one support in my CrocFit app. So make sure you download it if you need that extra help. Okay, give this video a thumbs up, click subscribe if you haven't already, and be sure to click the notification bell so you don't miss my workouts. All right, see you later. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.